Jesus gives a pretty strict warning about practicing our righteousness in front of other people. He tells the people not to go giving so that everyone sees it and says, wow, how amazing are you for all that giving? He tells them not to fast in such a way that they're, they're looking just terrible and they just feel miserable and everyone says, look how devoted he is. He's, he's fasting. He tells them not to go and just seek the praise of others. Don't go and pray in such a way that everyone says, wow, he's really holy and amazing. And yet we see in scripture that we are to live out this Christian life. We are to be good examples. A lot of times we, we think about fasting and prayer and giving, and we get afraid to do it at all because we don't want to look too righteous. We don't want the praise of others. Well, that's true. We don't want to do those things for those purposes, but Jesus doesn't say, don't pray, don't fast, don't give. Instead, Jesus reminds us that we are to keep the purpose in mind. We remember that, that this belly down here is not our God, that we get our daily bread from the Lord. We remember that we are ourselves helpless, that we need the Lord in the midst of all circumstances, and so we pray to him for all that we need in body and soul to life everlasting. And we give knowing that the love of stuff, the love of mammon, wealth as a whole, is something that is a danger to our very souls. And so we say, Lord, help us to give freely and joyfully, knowing that you have given your own life for us, that through the death and resurrection of Christ, he gave up his own blood to save us. And so as we go through the season of Lent, we remember that it is a time of, of backing off, not just not feasting, but specifically preparing ourselves for the great celebration. The Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world died and rose again, and we prepare ourselves for that celebration. We're, we're used to the feasting, but we're not always used to the fasting. We, we enjoy the getting, but sometimes we forget about how to give. And we know we need to ask the Lord for stuff, but sometimes we get to a little bit too self-reliant. And so we remember Jesus' words not to do these things so that others will praise us, but we do these things looking to the Lord, looking to the one who gives us our daily bread, looking to the one that hears our prayers and is a good father who gives us what we need, and knowing that he is the one who will provide for us, and so we give to others who are in need, knowing that the Lord is always hearing our prayers and giving us what we need, bringing us to, to faith and peace by the power of his Spirit through the promise of Jesus Christ, our Lord. And so go in peace, praying, fasting, giving, not for the praise of others, but to the glory of God. And be able to share this joy with others, knowing that you have everything that you need through your Father in heaven. Go in peace and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.